Let's see how fast models can be created using Solid Edge with synchronous technology. Starting in the context of this mountain bike assembly, we'll model a part that connects the forks to the handlebar support. Because the shock absorbers are in a fixed location, we'll start here by drawing some circles that will eventually become the alignment holes. When drawing elements, you can use other parts as a guide, guaranteeing fit and position. We could use the handlebar support for a reference, but for now we'll just place its mounting hole in a convenient location and then position it later. While we know the locations of the fixed components, we don't have a clear picture of how to connect the shocks to the handlebar support, so we'll figure that out as we go. Hiding the assembly will let us focus on part creation. The mounting holes need to be connected, so we'll draw some lines to outline the general shape. While drawing, notice how Solid Edge has several drawing aids to help you create 2D sketches. For example, special icons display when certain key points are located, and alignment lines help you draw perfect horizontal or vertical lines. Closed sketches become regions and display a grab-and-go handle, so a quick pull creates 3D features. In fact, the interface promotes this rabbit approach to modeling. Notice how the command bar lists sketch commands along with 3D modeling tools. To keep the forks a good distance away from the bike frame, we'll raise the area for the handlebar support. You can draw sketches directly on geometry with a full complement of tools to control both position and shape. Creating cutouts or extrusions using a traditional CAD system would require different commands with lengthy steps, but with Solid Edge we were able to develop this complete model with no 3D commands. As we grab the region, watch how material can be added or removed with a simple push or pull. Solid Edge lets you refine your designs during the creation process. Watch how the hole stays concentric as we drag the blend around. Likewise, we can move the hole and the model updates. This flexibility will come in handy later when we position the model to the handlebar support. While the part is functionally correct, it isn't visually appealing, so let's add some flash by tapering the vertical supports. Edits don't have to follow create steps, so your designs can be easily adapted to just about any shape. A traditional CAD system can't make these modifications without some serious feature rework. We'll complete the design by adding blends to edges. A fence select operation speeds the process while allowing individual edges to be removed from the blend set. Let's display the rest of the assembly and position our new part to match the handlebar support. Refining your design is simple. Just grab the desired geometry and snap it to other parts. First, we'll align the mounting hole to the handlebar support, and then we'll adjust the height to match the base of the support. Notice, as we make these changes, we're interacting directly with the geometry, never running special commands. The fewer the commands, the more productive the process will be. A key point with this technology is that the system keeps the model intact throughout the process. All edges stay blended, mounting holes stay concentric, and orthogonal faces remain that way. Solid Edge with synchronous technology is the only CAD system that lets you capture your ideas as fast as you think them.